So as I told, like we are going to use sample application from the Docker Hub. So this is the one which I, I was talking about. So this you can get it like from here. You can simply write a Docker sample application. You will get this. You can just click on this. So you will get this page. So here you can as you can read that this is a sample application which we can use. So this is a simple to do application. Okay. So how we, we have to use it like either you can uh, start using like you can clone it or you can download the zip to your local system. You can unzip it, unzip it and then you can use some code editor with the help of that you can uh, push it to github and then you can use it so i will be downloading it first and then unzipping it and then i'll be using visual code editor and that i'm going to push it to github so in this uh, file we will be having uh, uh, like uh, not only these two uh, folders but more folders and files will, uh, will be there but we are interested only in the app folder so as you can see, we are interested only in this app folder and this, these are the content of this app folder. Okay. So uh, once you will download it, it will get downloaded and so to download it, click on this one. So as soon as you click on this one, you'll get this download. So after that, go to your download. Okay. Here you'll get that zip folder, unzip it, extract it. So I'm extracting here only. So this is extracted one. So we have to go inside and as we can see here, one app folder is there. We are interested only in this. So now what we are going to do is like we are going to use open it in our uh, Visual Studio code. Okay. So let me open my Visual code editor. So here we have to open that folder. So I perfect this. So uh, here you can click on that and uh, you just have to select this folder and then select folder it will open okay as soon as it will open you will find this kind of uh, folder structure okay you will find spec and source and then factor version and yarn.log so in this we are having all the dependencies and all the here codes and all are there which are required for this application so after this what we have to do is like we have to create one docker file so this will be used to uh, create image custom image so after creating this docker file we have to go here so as as per instruction so what we have to do is like we have to write this docker file over there so uh, in this docker file what we are doing is like we are uh, taking a, a alpine based node node image okay and then in that uh, we are downloading python 2 g plus plus and make which will help to compile the uh, code okay and then we are making this slash app as a working directory uh, and we are copying the code okay after that this we are uh, uh, we are installing dependencies so hyphen production will have to uh, install the dependencies okay and we are exposing the uh, this application at 3000 port okay so uh, we just have to copy it from here and we can paste it in our docker file so after that you can save it so our next work is to push this code to our git repository okay so for that we will uh, we are going to create one repository and we are going to push this code to the uh, git repository so let's see how to do that <laughs> 